COVID-19 around the world. WHO continues to monitor and respond to this outbreak constantly. I will update these questions and answers as more knowledge becomes available about COVID-19 disease, how it is spreading, and how they are people around the world. What is coronavirus? Coronaviruses are a wide range of viruses that may cause disease in animals and humans. It is known that coronaviruses cause in humans respiratory diseases that range from common colds to more severe diseases such as Middle East Respiratory Syndrome MERS, and Severe Acute Respiratory Syndrome SARS. The newly discovered coronavirus causes COVID-19 disease. What is COVID-19 disease? COVID-19 disease is an infectious disease caused by the last detected virus of the coronavirus. There was no knowledge of the existence and disease of this new virus before its outbreak in Wuhan, China, in December 2019. COVID-19 has now become a pandemic to many countries in the world. What are the symptoms of COVID-19 disease? It shows the symptoms that support it for COVID-19 disease in fever, dry cough and fatigue. Some patients may experience pain and aches, nasal congestion, throat pain, or diarrhea and research what these symptoms are mild and begin gradually. Some people become infected but only very mild symptoms appear. Most people about 80 recover from the disease without needing hospital treatment. And the severity of the disease intensifies in approximately one person out of every five people who develop COVID-19 infection, who suffer from difficulty breathing. The risk of serious complications increases among the elderly, and people who already have medical problems, such as high blood pressure or heart and lung disease, diabetes or cancer. But anyone can develop a COVID-19 infection with severe symptoms. Even people with very light COFED-19 preview can pass the virus on to others. Provides all people with fever, cough and difficulty breathing to seek medical attention, regardless of age. What do I do if I have COVID-19 symptoms and when should I seek medical attention? If your symptoms are mild, such as a slight cough or a slight fever, there is generally no need to seek medical attention. Stay home, isolate yourself and monitor your symptoms. And follow the national guidelines for self-isolation. But if you live in an area where malaria or dengue fever is common, you should not ignore the symptoms of fever. Seek medical help. When you go to the health care facility, put a muzzle if possible, keep at least one meter three feet, between you and others, and avoid touching the surfaces around your hands. If the patient is a child, help them adhere to these tips. Seek medical attention right away if you experience difficulty breathing or chest pain, pressure. Call your doctor, if possible, so that he can guide you to the appropriate health facility. So far, virus statistics have arrived around the world, for confirmed cases there are 4.71 million the number of recovery cases 1.73 million the number of deaths is 315,000. America arrived in particular to me number of confirmed cases to 1.52 million healing cases number 281,000 deaths number 89,932. A glimpse of this data fast changing this data is rapidly changing and may not reflect some of the cases that are currently recorded. Only includes people who have been examined cases include only people who have undergone tests and have had positive results. The rules for conducting examinations and their availability vary from country to country. Data for some regions may not be available, either because the stakeholders have not published any data at all, or because the published data is out of date. Why do different data appear from different sources? There are various sources that track and collect data related to coronavirus. These sources update the data at different times and may adopt different methods of collecting it, 